How's it going, you guys? What's up? Marty Schwartz here with GuitarJams.com. Uh, gonna break <clears throat> break this classic down for you. But anyway, right now I tuned my guitar down to E flat. So just every string is one half step down, and um, I've got a, just a light bit of chorus on my um, on my amp here. Just adds a little bit of that extra flavor that's from the original, and uh, we'll just break it down. Here we go. The way we want to tackle this is to be able to play a G, a C, and an F, all kind of with the same fingering. So for our G chord, we're going to have our ring finger on the third fret of the low E and our middle finger on the second fret of the A, and then our pinky on the third fret of the high E. I'm actually going to turn this chorus off right now just so we can really hear what's going on. So you want to be able to do that first. The next thing, we're going to keep our pinky for the whole intro on this spot right here. So we got this. Da -da 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 -da. Then with these three fingers while that's planted, we're going to hammer on a C major chord. Then we need the F, which is going to be these two fingers scooted back a string to C to G. So watch. And that little ding dong 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 is going to be a hammer on the second fret of the G string, then open, then the same thing on the D string. And that open D is the first strum of the G again. And, and when you do those hammer-ons, it's while you're strumming. Like... So, yeah. Pick it, pick a winner. <laughs> so we're gonna <laughs> strum it, and then we're gonna do a pattern. Um, it's just down the one, two, three. Back to the first string. And then I, when I'm here, see the chorus kind of blends the notes together a little more. So I'm hearing this. Skipping that B string on the way back, like one, two, three, one, three. So watch again on my right hand. This is a G chord, watch my right hand here. Then we're gonna go one, two, three, two. So we got. Right into that C strum. Check it out again. Really slow. We do that C chord, you know, we strum the whole chord, do the same pattern. So we're going to hammer on that F. And I'm just going one, two, three, and then a sh so you kind of get that F, then a C. So watch. <laughs> <laughs> 